time for another fun day for Chelsea. Now I have to go wake my best friend Mika. Good morning, best friend Mika. Chelsea, love you. It's time for a fun day. Chelsea, why'd you wake me up? Sorry, Mika. Good chance she will play with you. Oh, right, I forgot. There's no chores today since it's a Saturday, so let's go play. Oh, uh, get off me, Chelsea. Chelsea is sorry, Mika. Chelsea just want to let you know that you Chelsea best friend, and you like a second sister to Chelsea. And thank you, Mika, for everything. And Chelsea really appreciate it. Um, thanks, Chelsea. You're my best friend, too. You really, Ch Chelsea, have a bad friend? Yes. <gasps> Chelsea, happy! Happy! Um, okay, before this gets any weirder, I'm going to be right back. Oh, hi, Tamika. Hi, Andrea. Ready to go play? I was going to play with Chelsea, but okay. You mean... That you don't like Chelsea? Chelsea, stop it. She's just going to play with me. You need to stop being so sensitive to everything people say. Uh, uh, okay. Do I, yeah. Thank you for telling Chelsea. Chelsea, love you. Um, well, actually, you two can stay here. I'm going to go text or something. Bye. Well, Chelsea, what do you want to play? Chelsea will play whatever you play, Mika. Could Chelsea love you and your Chelsea bear friend? Chelsea, can you please stop saying that? I get the picture. What do you want to play? Chelsea is sorry. Um, okay, Chelsea, please stop. I'm just trying to ask you what you want to play. Okay, Chelsea want to play patty cake. That's for little kids. But Chelsea a little kid. I give up. I'm going to go play with Dandrea. Oh, well, it's okay if Mika play with Dwea. I can just go get Dwea's. Can somebody help? Oh, I'm tired of driving. I'm just going to take a little rest for now. I can't take it anymore. I have to let go. Huh? Something soft? <gasps> this is the top of the golf cart. That must mean that uh, there's something on the top of the roof disturbing me from my nap. I better go see what it is. Stacy? Skipper? Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! I missed you so much and I was very worried about you. I was very worried about you too, Skipper. I'm glad I'm back with you. I am too. Well, let's continue the search for Chelsea. <laughs> Wait a minute, what am I doing? Of course the police should be out there looking for them, but I should too. They're my sisters. And you know what? I failed both of them, all three of them. I failed Skipper and Stacy because I told them they were going to have a little sister in such a wrong way. I should not have told them two days before. I should have given them weeks, maybe a month. And I should have told them more nicely. And I should have told them the good things of having a sister. And as for Chelsea, she's just the little baby girl, the cutest little thing ever, and she just wants a nice, loving family. And most importantly, she wants to be loved. And I think I've been giving her love, but Skipper and Stacy just been giving her hate, hate, hate. So, now, Chelsea, if she is still alive, is just out there. Just out there, thinking of all the mean things Skipper and Stacy said. And as for me, the last thing I said to her was, what's the last thing I did say to her? Hey, baby, you play with Chelsea? No, Chelsea, I'm busy. I told you like ten times. Go get your swimsuit on. We're going to the beach. You yell at Chelsea. Well, maybe if you would go re get ready, Chelsea, please. But why? Because I said so. Okay, Chelsea is sorry. Because I said so. What a terrible thing to say to my little sister. I'm such an awful person. I can't believe I let this happen. 
I can't believe I didn't put up with Skipper and Stacy's mean behavior towards her for all these years. This is all my fault. The least I ever did was when Skipper slapped Chelsea. I put her on a ten minute timeout. I am ashamed of myself. You know what? I'm going to look for Chelsea and Skipper and Stacy right now. Before Chelsea go and put Chelsea go get dressed. Ooh, I dry a closet. Do I have no mind if Chelsea borrow something? Chelsea's hair. Wow, this TV show is actually quite entertaining. Oh wow, I'm just now realizing I have a stain on my dress. I better go change. Oh my goodness, my closet's a wreck. Who could have done this? Hi, Dwaya. Chelsea, love you. Oh my goodness, this ugly creature! Mom! <clears throat> Wait a minute. Chelsea? You're an ugly creature? You like Chelsea hair? Um, no. I mean, yes, it's beautiful. Where'd you get all those things? They throw that pig thing. I can't believe this, Chelsea. You broke my guitar. After all I've done for you. I brushed your hair, I let you use my clothes, I let you sleep in my bed, and I kissed you goodnight. I, Sally, you could get new ta. No, I can't. Because my dad gave this to me before he left. He come back, he got you new. No, he can't. Why don't you understand that? I just don't. Okay, well, I'm just letting you know that you just ruined a very important part of my life. <gasps> Why? Well, I'm sorry. Oh, boy. I'm being bad. Ugh, I need to leave the house before I be bad anymore. Well, okay, wait. And Chelsea all ready to go. I better go say goodbye to everyone and then leave. I know you're sweet, Mika. But Chelsea just won't let you know. Thank you for being Chelsea's first and only best friend. And Chelsea will never forget you. And I'm sorry for being bad. And thank you for everything. Bye. <coughs> well, I'm all ready to go. I better go leave. Mom! Hi, Andrea. Guess what? Chelsea broke Dad's guitar. No. Yes! I'm so angry at her. I'm so sorry, Andrea. That guitar was very special to our family. But she's only three. I don't care. That guitar was special to me. And if she's three or not, that's not going to matter. The guitar is broken. And that's all that matters. Well, honey, if it makes you feel better, I actually got in contact with Chelsea's sister, Barbie. Really? Yes, and Barbie will be here to get Chelsea tomorrow morning. Oh, that's great! I know! I'm so glad Chelsea has her sister back. I know. Where's Chelsea right now? Oh, I think she's still, she's asleep. Well, she's probably tired. I can't wait to tell her the great news tomorrow. I know. Well, I'm gonna go get some sleep. Okay, good night, Andrea. Good night, Mom. Love you. I'm done crying now. I hope I don't be bad here. I better go somewhere else. <laughs> 